Liam Healy is here with us now. Should we be on the lookout for that again tonight, Liam? We should be, but it's going to be some tough conditions out here in Western New York, unfortunately. So we might just have to take this is from what I captured last night and enjoy it for what it is. We had a few clouds around, but the skies tonight are going to multiply these clouds by about 100 times as we begin to get into another really good potential to see this Aurora across the area up to G4, maybe even G5 conditions. Once again, viewing opportunities across a lot of the US. But we've talked about it earlier and you've kind of noticed a little bit more cloud cover moving in today versus maybe what we had this time yesterday as we started to clear out on Friday night. Now we have a big low pressure that's beginning to trek eastward. And as we get into the overnight hours and those prime viewing times, the Aurora, it's going to be cloudy and that's going to be parked right over us. So let's put future view into motion here. We'll get you a kind of an idea. Just widespread cloud cover. Still some showers coming through. This is not to say maybe there won't be a break in the cloud somewhere, but really our opportunities tonight are definitely a lot more limited, but there are more opportunities into Sunday night and Monday with clear skies potentially and good chances for the Aurora. We've got details on that on our website.